Okay guys, honestly this video is long overdue, so I was at the Lake Worth uh, sports car show about, really uh, about a month and a half or two months now I think. And I was just walking around looking at different vendors, uh, they had only like one or two Pokemon card vendors. Uh, so as I walked around I saw this uh, sports card vendor, he had all sports cards for the exception of these two base set 2 booster packs. So guys, I ended up picking both of these up for a total of $250. He gave me a crazy deal on this. So uh, guys, I'm going to open these now. Uh, go ahead, uh, sit back, grab some snacks, and guys, let's dive right into it. All right, you guys, I got my two base set two booster packs right in front of me. I got the Pikachu artwork and the Pidgeot. And honestly, guys, I've been I've been holding on to these for a while, but I finally decided to open them. Uh, I almost feel bad, honestly. They're just uh, so nice. And as you can see, uh, these packs have the little number two here uh, logo. And as you'll see, these are on the cards themselves. That's how you could tell the difference between a uh, base set and base set two packs or Pokemon cards. And uh, yeah, also the difference is this is from, uh, I actually got this in the PokerRef Mega Bonus Mystery Packs. If you guys haven't seen that video, go ahead and check it out. And I opened this, but uh, as you know, these, these have the Venusaur, Charizard, and Blastoise. On the front I think I'm gonna go ahead and get started with this uh, Pidgeot booster pack and let's just take a second to look at this so as you can see on the back here it says a uh, wizard of the wizards of the coast uh, official Nintendo product all right guys so without further ado let's get right into it and yeah this is just a very nice pack uh, also there are two other artworks there's that uh, Mewtwo uh, which is like a red uh, front and then there's a Gyarados with like a yellow background so let's go ahead and get started with this Pidgeot booster pack and let's see if we can get lucky. I want to try to open this as carefully as possible because I actually do want to conserve uh, these packs. I still have that base set one as you just saw. I just want to uh, keep them and let's see, I see a Cubone in the front there. I actually already messed this up. Let's see. Alright, we see a cute little cute bone. Oh, what is this? I think the card trick is three from the back. I should have double checked before starting. Here, let me. I'll spoil myself if anything, not you guys. Let me take it off the screen. Okay, I did it right. And uh, yeah, we got a energy card, double co colorless energy here. And man, the nostalgia, guys! Just looking back at these older, older sets. Let's see if we could get lucky. I want to make sure I got some nice lighting here. All right, let's see. So we got that double colorless energy. Got a Butterfree. Got a Marowak. Got that Cubone. Got a Doodle. Magnemite. Man, I just love seeing all these old vintage cards. Got a Caterpie. Classic. Got a Poliwag. There's the Energy card. And let's see what our last card is going to be. We got... We got a Kangaskhan non-holo. I'll take it though. And yeah, guys, this is what I was telling you. They have that little uh, symbol here, the number two. Showing that it's from the base set too. Alright you guys, no luck on that one. So let's see if we could get lucky with this Raichu pack here. Alright, let's see if I can open this. Oh, ended up... I ended up tearing it wrong. But I was trying to conserve the pack because these are really nice. I just like holding on to them. But let's see, I'll try not to mess it up too much. Got a cute little Vulpix. It's a really cool Vulpix with a black background there. All right, let's see. So it is three from the back. I was right. And let's see what we can get. All right, guys, we got a Firo, Executor. Got a Seeking. There's a Vulpix. You got Energy Removal. Got an Onyx. Got a Nidoran, Pidgey, got the Energy, 
leaf energy and let's see what our last card is let's see what we got oh no way let's go we got a blastoise hollow oh my god oh my god guys we did it we got a crazy pull here today and we got the blastoise hollow from the base set too oh my god no way wow this is the second most expensive card i believe in this set i gotta check how much this goes for oh this is amazing guys and it looks pretty good pretty good condition honestly wow i'm speechless guys <laughs> we got a blast toys hollow from the base set too guys i can't believe i just pulled this blast toys look at that i already got my boy all sleeved up and top loaded i got this pretty cool uh, pokemon top loader uh but wow guys that's insane i'm not gonna lie i was a little bit uh skeptical uh because i did get a really good deal on these two packs uh they're usually worth 200 each and i got both of them for 250 so i got a crazy deal i was a little scared they might be weighed but they weren't. As you can see, I got this awesome Blastoise that I'm going to add to my collection. And uh, that's it for today, guys. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Also, check out my other videos, and I'll see you guys next time.